Hello, good afternoon. This is Nasir, and uh, this is our second video of uh, cloud hosting series. Uh, in this video, I'm going to show you how to install one click uh, WordPress app on Atlantic.net, which is the second uh, uh, most famous cloud hosting service provider. Uh, it's very reliable, fast, and secure. And uh, it's very easy to install WordPress uh, uh, on Atlantic.net they have a good support plan also and they are offering a $15 uh, uh, credit as a referral bonus if you want uh, you can click on the link uh, uh, in this video uh, there is a sign up link in this uh, link in this video if you click uh, that link and sign up you will get $15 uh, uh, as a sign up bonus and uh, you can use that to create your uh, WordPress app or and, uh, deploy your server so let's uh, go to Atlantic.net and see what their pricing are Alright, so they have a uh, G2.1 uh, gigabyte, G2.1 GB, and then G2.2 GB, G2.4 GB, G2.8 GB. G2.1 GB is uh, the most basic one, which costs around uh, $8 per month uh, if you choose uh, to be uh, choose to have a Linux based server. And if you choose Windows Server, it would be $14 per month. Also, this eight dollars per month is uh, applicable when you choose their services uh, for three years. But if you are using it independently for PSGO uh, basis, uh, there will be no discount available. Uh, rather, it would cost you around ten dollars per month. Uh, so let's try to you know you just need to click on sign up button here and then you have to go through the sign up process just fill in your details of uh, the billing details your name email address verify your email uh, once you are in then uh, you will get to the uh, dashboard once your account is activated now uh, I already have an activate active account uh, let me go and sign up uh, sign in actually uh, remove this so you need to go to cloud.atlantic.net to sign into your uh, account alright so here is my account I already created one uh, server and then it has been completely removed now now in order to install a WordPress app you have to click on add server button here uh, this is the screen that you would also get once you log into your account now name the server or uh, you can just name anything hog dive uh, test one and then select the location you would like to deploy your server at uh, I'm gonna select Toronto and then uh, you have option to select operating system or applications so if you just want to have an operating system installed and uh, installing the application and uh, uh, LAMP or other software stack uh, uh, you know would be managed by yourself then you can go with this option select Ubuntu and the version you would like uh, 16.04 32 bit 16.04 64-bit uh, but here in this one I would be installing a uh, WordPress now so I'll select 16.04 uh, and then application would be Ubuntu uh, so WordPress on 16.04 and then uh, it would be on on demand term which would have no discount applied and the cost would for the G2 1 GB would be $10 per month this one uh, if I select one year it would be $9 if I select three years it would be $8 per month so let's go with the on demand option and uh, if you select uh, uh, enable backup it would be charged additionally so I'll just go and click create server and uh, you will quickly see the status of the server will be deploying okay your server will be provisioned shortly it's building here's the status and these are the login details uh, this is the IP address and then root and then your password for root account and uh, you would also be sent an email once the server is up and running which would have uh, probably the details about WordPress login uh, let's see how it goes and uh, these are the details about uh, DNS servers uh, Ubuntu and the servers configuration and it's provisioned so it's like already running 
uh, reboot, resize, reset password, backup, provision, reprovision, delete. So all these options will be available on the top. Uh, now let's see uh, what it says. Uh, if I go to this uh, URL now, okay, it says please use the full URL displayed in the email that was sent to you when attempting to access your site for the first time. So you must need to verify. It's actually a verify page. It's redirecting me to. You have to verify before you can use the WordPress site. So it is very quick. You saw. You saw that uh, it just got installed with the WordPress and all the software stack so I'll just go to my email and uh, see if I have received any email from Atlantic alright there it is and uh, there is the link uh, so this is server login I IP address root and then password root password but to set up WordPress you need to follow this link so I'll go to this link and uh, it will ask me to install WordPress uh, the same as we did in Vulture and uh, let me click continue and site title should be let's say uh, WordPress on Atlantic dot net username would be admin and the password is admin at one two three confirm use of weak password your email okay discourage uh, I don't want search engine to index this site right now so install WordPress and uh, WordPress has been installed thank you now login and I can login here admin at one two three alright and I'm into the dashboard now if I want I can see the website how it looks and this is my WordPress on Atlantic.net that I just installed I want to go to this uh, post uh, it's right there now let me create a post from somewhere okay let's see this is the content no, don't choose that content actually uh, let's try Atlantic that night how to install SSO this is just for the testing purpose I'm just creating a post and uh, I will try to open it right there it is it's published it should be right here uh, the home page okay press one click app on Atlantic and it's right there you see it's very fast I just click and then it takes me there so obviously the cloud computing is fast now if I need to redirect my domain to this one also before I do that let me also change the uh, theme so that I will be a little different okay um, save add new try this one install Alright, so this is going to be my new theme for the WordPress installed on Atlantic.net. Okay, let me also update the WordPress as it says install WooCommerce. No, I don't update now. Okay, it's because server is busy upgrading the WordPress in the back end okay now let me try the website and see how it looks 
alright so this is my new theme it's home page and it has two posts no images I have not uploaded any image yet sample page right there it is and then these are the recent post alright so looks like uh, the website is running with the IP address now I need to redirect uh, my domain to this website so this is how it is done I'll uh, go to okay let's refresh and then that server would appear here okay this is my server uh, I'll go to DNS add domain uh, valley of links dot com alright so these are the NS record that I need to update in my hosting service provider ns1.quickroutedns.com uh, let's go back to the domain registrar uh, it's right here uh, this is where I have registered my domain value of links.com from so I'll go to the name server section and then change the name server uh, it may ask me to log in again because I'm sure that it's, mm, the session has been timed out uh, it's been a long time I logged into this account okay it's the login page uh, let's log in select the domain and go to the name server remove vulture and then put in uh, ns1 I think it's ns1 ns2 ns3 dot quick route dns dot com all right just make it two and this one three update name server it may take few minutes but let me try a different browser and see if it's going to open it may take a minute or two alrighty I'm going to open this in Firefox the website that the uh, domain should open should be this one 69.87 and it should say wordpress on atlantic.net just another website and I we have uh, two pages so I'm going to try this uh, now in the world in uh, Firefox I have never opened this website here so there is no chance of uh, opening website from cache uh, value of links dot com uh, like I said it may take s few minutes to an hour totally depending upon the DNS uh, how it is handled and managed by the name server connection time yeah so I think uh, it's not uh, filling up the website because of the uh, cache in the internet service providers record now let's try with the uh, different uh, service provider or maybe try to use proxy or VPN connection and load the website I'll uh, open my VPN connection software link uh, Hawks is a kind of VPN software which connects you through a different locations um, let me connect uh, from anywhere maybe Sweden okay and then uh, I should try to access the website now okay it's connected now let's try to access value of link and there you go it's opening website wordpress on atlantic.net the website would load a little slower here because it's through a third party VPN connection a public VPN which is always slower uh, it's a uh, proxy actually so my website is just opened and uh, 
it is the same you see the uh, IP address here so if I go into the WordPress admin I can change the website URL and uh, So we are into the dashboard. Uh, dismiss this and then uh, go to settings, general. And here, put in the value of links. and then hit save and let's try to open the website and it's just open if I click sample page it also open with the same URL post click open with the name the word so it's inside the same domain so it looks like it's working faster better and the website is up and running so this is how we install wordpress a like one click app on atlantic.net uh, you have some other software available to install with atlantic uh, if you go into the add new server option you will get to see these options and uh, these are let's see applications are lamp docker cpanel cpanel is uh, whm software web host uh, manager wherein you can uh, uh, you know you may need to pay additional fifteen dollars for that and uh, for the license and but that would allow you to install uh, a lot of websites and uh, manage them uh, issue certificate ssl for them so lots of things that you can do um, and uh, so this was the easiest way to install one click app uh, now so that was all about uh, installing WordPress one click app on Atlantic.net which is the second most famous uh, cloud hosting service provider uh, I hope you like this video please hit uh, like and subscribe to our channel uh, to get uh, latest news and update from uh, hogdive.com uh, also at the bottom of this video in the description section we have put in the sign up link uh, if you want you can uh, sign up to atlantic.com by following the link you will be able to get a $15 credit from atlantic.net thanks again you have a wonderful day ahead